Okay, let's say you're given a meter stick, and this is our meter stick here. And you're asked to find the width of, let's say, a block, and let's say this is our block. How would you go about doing that using your meter stick? All right, so if you're using the meter stick to find the length of a block, what you want to do is you want to match up the end of the block here to the end of the meter stick, all right, and make sure that the two pieces are nice and flush here so they create a nice line, if you will, between there, okay, and you look to see how far the block goes at the other end of the meter stick there. In order to figure that out, what we're going to do is we're going to zoom in just a little bit so that we can get a better reading here on the block. All right, so there we have the end of the block. All right, so if you notice on this meter stick, we have the number 10 here and then one, what this is saying is that this is 10 centimeters, this becomes 11 centimeters, so on and so forth. All right, and if you look at the, the, the uh, dimensions here or the, the scale here, you notice that the block is past the number seven and almost, if not approximately, to this uh, mark right here. So in order to figure out what this mark is and to figure out the length of the block, we'll count from past seven. This would be one mark, two mark, three marks, four marks, five marks. So this is approximately 7.50 uh, in terms of the distance or the width of this block, all right? So again, when we match up the end down here, using the meter stick, this block ends up being, and let me make sure they're nice and matched up again. There we go. This block ends up being approximately seven centimeters, 7.50 centimeters, okay? The reason why I added the zero at the end is because let's say the block went to halfway in between here, we would be saying that it's at least 7.5 and we'll be guessing the last digit and that last digit, if it was to go a little past that block, would be approximately, let's say five, okay? That's the precision of this uh, measurement, uh, of this measurement device being the meter stick that we can get two decimal places after the uh, decimal point. So we can get two digits after the decimal point, okay? So the reason why I know also that this is, uh, uh, these are in centimeters is because if we go over to the end over here, you'll notice that we get to 90, and then this means that the end is 100, and there are 100 centimeters in one meter. So that's why I know that the measurement here would be as I indicated for the block, 7.5 and approximately zero being the last uh, digit there. That's the guess that we use, all right? So that's how you use a meter stick in order to find, let's say, length, uh, width, or height of an object.